In this video, we will be looking if we can make a good roller coaster with a pivot offset of 8. And you might ask, Timon, 8 is not possible. Yes, it is. As you can see right here, you have the pivot offset slider. You can put it all the way up to 4. But when you are going to type, you can go all the way up to 8. 8 when you are going to start rotating some of the tracks it starts to do some very interesting things so let's just see if we can make a good coaster with this so we are just going to start properly with the station actually a little bit in the air because i want to try to start with some sort of like barrel so let's put that on 8 let's have a look on how this is going to work what if i put this on 90 degrees oh yeah, this, this is um, going to be fun. So what if I just slowly rotate it in the begin? Uh, of course, it needs to go down. But that should make it hopefully more smooth. I Pivot offset is not really a great way to build a roller coaster, guys. That's just already my first tip. So don't do this because it's, it's probably not going to work. But that's why we're going to try and see if we can make a good roller coaster. And I have so my guesses it's going to be an interesting challenge. Okay. Let's just continue with this turn. Yeah, we are definitely going for the ground right here. I guess just continue this turn for now because I want to sort of have this angle. And then we're going to reset it. Okay, that's not too bad. And then we are probably going to have the lounge just straight in there. Now, of course, we cannot see the lounge. So let's delete some of the terrain. There we go. Okay, let's... This barrel already looks... Uh, quite weird. I actually want to see if it is at, at least smooth. And I guess it's a great inversion to test and see if it actually makes it. I, I think it will. Probably just going to go very slowly through it. Actually, it's not terrible. It's maybe just that pivot offset 8 is just way too much. But it, it works. So that's great. We make it to the lounge. So let's continue. But before we continue, as you can see, only 20% is actually subscribed. So if you have subscribed, please consider it. It would help a lot. Okay, so so what now? That is a very, very good question. Maybe one more booster and then we are going to go up. We still have pivot uh, offset 8 enabled. Of course, straight pieces are no problem. But everything that has banking in it is going to be very curious. It is, it's going to be a weird looking roller coaster, guys. But I kind of want to try this. But I might need to like rotate it less. Otherwise, oh yeah, as you saw it, it, it looks very weird. So let's rotate this very long. And then we're probably going, I guess... Oh, also down. Okay, it did. This actually does not look very bad. It's just it's it's so wrong building like this. Okay, and then we're of course also going to go down and then also rotate it a lot. That doesn't look too bad. It's just it's weird. Yeah, I guess that's going to be the whole coaster. Especially it's going to do weird stuff when you're now going to rotate it back again. Like <laughs> oh no, <laughs> well, that doesn't work. So I guess what I kind of need to do is just continue the rotation to make it sort of smooth. So let's see if this sort of works. And I think I might even have to add a bit more lining in there. Yeah, that, that looks all right. Okay, and then we are just going to add like a turn like this, which is not going to be too hard. And then I kind of want to add like a overbanked turn. Not an inversion, but it's going to be like overbanked like this. Of course, a bit rotated. And then it's going to go down and rotate back again. No idea if that is going to be smooth, guys. But it does look interesting. Okay, and then we're going to rotate it all the way. It, it just does so much banking it's just way too much like pivot offset 2 is sort of like the way to go if you want to build some sort of like easy smooth roller coaster but 8 it's it's no <laughs> no <laughs> Okay, let's add like some S turn right here. So we're going to the other side and I, I'm probably going to say it a lot this video. It's, it's kind of cursed in some way, but it also works. I, I'm not I'm not sure if I like it. <laughs> Do another S turn like right here. It is also going to be a very weird layout by the looks of things. But yeah, the, the, the thing that's really nice to do with people is that A is like these S turns because as you can see, they just become very easy smooth, which is I guess really nice to do. I kind of want to sort of like go in a turn and then in some sort of like inversion over the lounge does that work i think it will work right yeah it probably will so what it's going to do is going to like all the way here and then we're going to uh, rotate it to the other side maybe a bit more roundish that looks nice can you but why can you even make it like as small as this it, it, it is hard to make a good roller coaster guys with this method it's it's i, I don't I, i'm not even sure why it's possible to do pivot offset a questionable dennis why 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 is is a possibility why not just limit it at four but i, I guess it's a, uh, it's a it's a fun challenge to do okay where am i going i'm probably going in another light turn just over oh my what the heck oh uh -huh. how how we 
is that possible? So it rotates like that around here. And I, I, I have questions. Let's maybe not do that. Okay, and I don't think I will be having that much speed left. So I guess we kind of have to just go around here and then into there maybe? I, I don't know how much speed we have. Maybe we have an, a lot of speed, but we'll be seeing that in a little bit. Okay, and now we're going to reset it. Because I kind of want to do like some sort of like airtime hill-ish thing. I guess that, that, that sort of like works right there. Look, stra straight track, no problem at all. But when I'm now going to rotate it and just do a slight turn, that just instantly is so cursed. And then we need to like sort of reset it, make it go down. That's, yeah, I guess works. It's good enough. Okay, let's add some brakes right in there. And let's get also the other side of the station. And let's add a few. And not boosters. Brakes, one, two, three. And now we are going to add some sort of force. Put this on pivotals at eight. Otherwise, I failed the challenge, guys. Let's continue this one. And even <laughs> even the, the this line is not going to the right point. Oh, that's hideous. Okay, let, let's just connect it straight into there. That's good enough. Okay, there we have our very interesting coaster. It's definitely not a long coaster. But I feel like if you would make this longer, it's going to be very rough. Okay, uh, it's a very interesting roller coaster. I guess we are just going to have a look at the POV. the question of this video can you make a good roller coaster with pivot offset 8 and i would actually say yes i think if you would take the time to actually really try and do it good yes you can probably make a good coaster with pivot offset 8 would i recommend building with pivot offset 8 no just keep it to like around two or three that's definitely enough not even four four is already too much and yeah eight don't do it you are going to get some very weird turns you it, it just it's it's weird it's you don't really have like a lot of possibilities to do with the track and otherwise as you see you are going to get some pretty weird results of some of like your turns but guys that's it for today i hope you guys have enjoyed this video if you did please leave a like and subscribe to my channel and let me know down below what i should do next in theme park tycoon 2 so guys i will say as always good bye